not gonna believe what I found, guys. I was just walking through my own backyard on my early morning jog, guys, like I always do, guys. And I found something crazy, guys. You're not gonna believe this, guys. Yo, guys, if you wanna see what I found, guys, you gotta smash that like button for me. Smash. Guys, if you wanna smash that like button for me, please smash that like button, guys. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold the phone, Leon. What the hell are you doing out there? I'm just trying out a new style of content that has been proven to work quite well. I wish you would just give me a chance. Okay, I'll, I'll play along. What do you got? You're never gonna believe it, guys. I was just walking through this park. It's so crazy. Guys, check this out, guys. Monkey in the tree, guys. Monkey in the tree. I found a monkey in the tree, guys. My guy. Got a monkey in the tree, guys. It's fucking crazy, guys. I can't even. I'm touching. I'm running from the grass, guys. I'm running from the grass. Look at this. Look at the grass, guys. Look at the grass, guys. Look at the grass, guys. Look. Please stop. The grass. The grass is touching my feet, guys. The grass is touching my feet. It's crazy, guys. It's crazy. I can't believe it's just happening, bro. I can't even look at the Holy fuck, a fence. The fence, guys. There's a fence. Look at the fence pose, guys. You beautiful bastards. Hope you're having a fantastic Saturday. Welcome back to the Leon Lush Franco show and let's just jump into it. Guys, y'all will not believe what I just found, guys. I was walking through the park on my early morning jog, guys, and I came across something crazy, guys, right in the middle of a park, guys. You guys are not gonna believe what I found. If you guys wanna see what I found right now, smash the like button, guys. Smash the like button right now because my discovery is insane, guys. You will not believe this. I cannot believe myself. Everybody smash the like button right now to see what I just found, guys. All right, so now you've had a quick glimpse into where my intro came from. And honestly, you've got a little idea of what we're up against in today's video. But before I talk about that disaster, I wanna talk about something that I actually love and that is having the time and the resources available to make these videos for you guys. And one of the driving factors behind me making these videos is being able to have sponsors that work with creators like myself. That's why I am thrilled to introduce you guys to today's video sponsor, War Robots. Now you have a way to support the Tomato Mafia without spending a dime and having fun while you're doing it. All you have to do is click the link below in my description and play a free game. War Robots is a free-to-play 6v6 tactical robot warfare game. It features a massive selection of robots to choose from and most importantly, it's fun to play. I myself have been having a blast playing as the Fury Robot. He's got long-range power, he's got three upgradable sniper-style weapons, and it really suits my style of long-range play. With over 70 million players worldwide, stunning graphics and a ton of maps and upgrades available, War Robots offers countless hours of fun and an unparalleled mobile gaming experience. When you download War Robots via my link below, you receive a free bonus pack that unlocks the powerful Leo Robot, which is pretty fitting considering, I mean, boom. <laughs> but you also get four upgraded weapons, 100 gold, and 400,000 silver to spend on whatever upgrades you want. This will give you a massive advantage to help you start owning noobs right off the bat. So if you like fun games and you want to help me continue to make videos like these, use your iPhone or Android and click that link below in the description and download War Robots today. Day. Day. Now shifting gears here back towards content that's not fun and free to play like War Robots is, I recommend getting your cyanide pills on deck because we are headed into the trenches and it's gonna be a battle. Introducing Eli So Cray, a YouTuber slash modern day revolutionary in all honesty that has somehow managed to amass 761,000 subscribers without having a single shred of watchable content on his entire YouTube channel. Now don't get confused, Eli has over 570 videos on his channel zero seconds of watchable content. To give you an idea of what we're working with here, just just look at this. Look at, look at it. Oh, look at that, yeah. Look at the AIDS. Oh, it's so, oh, the titles and the thumbnail, my God. Uh, you know, looking through Eli's video page here, it's not so different than looking down a microscope at the inside of a cancer cell. Really, Leon? A cancer joke? Don't you think that's rather insensitive? You know what, you're absolutely right, and I do apologize. I will make sure to keep my jokes to AIDS, cystic fibrosis, and lupus from here on out. No more, no more, no more cancer jokes. Now, it's one thing to hop on a trend, right? Make a video about something that's popular at the time and get some views. I'm all about that. Leon Lush loves that shit. But it's another thing to make 68 videos about Georgie and Pennywise. That's right, 68 videos about the movie It. Now, more recently, maybe you're familiar with this Dame Tu Cosita song. Dame Tu Cosita. Uh, uh. Dame Tu Cosita. Uh. I? It blew up not that long ago. It made its rounds on the internet, almost has 400 million views on YouTube. And what does a normal person do, right? You make a video, maybe two. 
talking about something that's trending to try and get a few views yourself. But what does Eli Socre do? Well, he's on some next level grind shit. 29 videos in less than three weeks about Dame Tu Cosita. That's right, I said 29. 10 plus minute videos about Dame Tu Cosita in less than three weeks. So to see how bad it was firsthand, I decided to participate in a little game called How Long Can I Watch Eli Socre While Sitting Next to a Large Kitchen Knife Without Actually Eviscerating Myself? And the results will shock you. He is the definition of quantity over quality. Two, sometimes three, 10 minute videos every single day. The goal! Now I think it would be too painful, physically and emotionally, to watch more than just a single video from Eli Socre, so I wanna steer our attention toward his channel trailer, or the video that he chose to feature on his YouTube homepage. Because typically that's the video you want the world to see to showcase, you know, your best stuff, right? And I mean, it's got 7.3 million views. 7.3 gulp million views. So it's, it's probably gonna be pretty good. Playing with Jordy Bolt in the water, he attacked me. OMG. Let me show you guys what I just now found. Now, a lesser known trade secret amongst the YouTube community that only some of the most elite YouTubers are privy to is the fact that the quality of one's video is directly correlated with the amount of Vine Boom sound effects. Turn into the right. Vine Boom. Important zoom in. Vine Boom. Punching a monkey. Fine, boom. Just sitting here, Georgie's boat, which leads me to believe Georgie has to be somewhere around this area, y'all. Oh my goodness, I see footprints too, look. There's footprints too, right here. Little foot, little footprints. That has to be Georgie's footprints, y'all. Now I'm kind of on the fence, to be honest, but, uh, yeah, I think this might be fake. You know, and you know, the crazy thing is, there's a water, there's water right around this area, guys. There's like a little lake. Whoa, 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 there's a lake? by the park that you're in? That is crazy. I'm gonna take this boat, go to the lake right now. Everybody smash the like button, share this video, turn on post notifications if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel, go subscribe to my vlog, channel. link will be down in the description. Go also follow me on Instagram, link will be down in the description at Eli underscore so underscore Cray. Woo, that was a mouthful, bro. Can you just put that in the description so I can read it at least? That's too much to take in. Anyways, two minutes and 20 seconds of absolutely nothing. The meat of the video is sure to be coming up next. Oh, how wrong I was. No meat was in sight, only fluff. With five plus minutes of him walking around aimlessly in the park talking about absolutely nothing, we're finally getting to the climax. All right, we're going to be riding his boat. We're going to disrespect Georgie. We're going to ride his boat in the sewage water. Ooh. Yeah, disrespect it. Yeah, that way. What a nice boat. Yeah. What a nice boat, Georgie. Finally, it gets good. I mean, I wasn't sure it was going to be worth the wait, but it's not very often you see boating skills like that. I mean, that is truly remarkable. Why did you see that to my boat? Because you just left it there. Why would you leave it there for? That's your fault. You should have never left it. Don't get close to me, bro. Oh, oh, oh. Eli! Eli, get out of there, Eli! Eli, go, Eli! <laughs> Alright, guys, so I just got away from George, that's all you guys have seen. What? He got upset because you got away? I played with his bow and got away. He got away! <sighs> what a roller coaster ride of emotions. <sighs> minute video filled with absolutely nothing except vine boom sound effects 
two to three times a day, upload those. 762,000 subscribers. If you read between the lines in this video, you literally have the success formula for YouTube. I mean, just get a cheap camera, shit, use your phone, it doesn't matter, just record yourself for 10 to 11 minutes doing absolutely fuck all, and then search on YouTube Vine Boom Sound Effect and rip that shit and toss it into your fucking video editor. And then just get your copy-paste fingers all warmed up, because there's gonna be a lot of copy-pasting going on, and then just fucking upload that shit. I don't know why more people aren't doing this. This guy had 7 million views the last 30 days. 762,000 people watched a video from this guy or landed on his page somehow, and after they were done, they sat down briefly, took a pause, and said, yeah, I'm gonna subscribe. <laughs> I would like to sit down in an interrogation room with every single one of the 762,000 people that willingly decided to subscribe to this man's YouTube page and beat the living piss out of them until they can give me one decent reason why that was a good idea. Just one reason that makes sense. Until then, I will just sit here patiently, befuddled and disenchanted as I ponder the reality of his social blade statistics compared to mine. <laughs> Boy. I do hope you enjoyed the video though. Normally I read some comments at the end, but I think I'm too depressed right now to do that. So we're just gonna wrap things up. Make sure you download War Robots. It really is a fun game. And I really appreciate those guys for sponsoring this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Obviously I'm having fun, right? I get a little dramatic uh, for the sake of the camera. But uh, no, actually, you know what? I was pretty dead serious in this one. What the fuck? What the fuck? Be sure to leave a comment, subscribe, and if you could just do me a small favor and just get a little travel size bottle of hair conditioner and squeeze just a little bit of that in each one of your eyes and then take a bottle of pepper spray and blow that up your asshole and then hip thrust that motherfucking like button for me. I'd appreciate it. Take care. Yeah. Yes. Yeah.